share with you how I restyle my Outre Batik Bundle Peruvian lace front wig into a simple top knot which is a half up half down hairdo so if you want to see more on how to restyle your wig into a style like this just keep watching the video and i will see you all in another video again shortly later dolls hey dolls so this is how i wear my hair underneath my wigs i just do two big braids and secure them with bobby pins and then i take a black stocking cap about 90% of the time and just put it over the two braids make sure it's nice and snug and secure and then I take whatever wig I'm wearing and this wig is the Outre Batik Bundle Peruvian Lace Front Wig and I take her and just placing her on my head as such and then once I secure her down I then take the wig and I flip the hair back as such so now that I'm looking at this from editing, she still looks pretty decent to say the most. Um, her parting space is still intact. I got a full detailed review about her. The link is down in the description box below, so you can check there for that. And I'm just going to separate her a little bit. And then I'm going to take my trusty old bottle of water. All I have inside of it is some conditioner and a little bit of argan oil. And I'm just spraying the wig to get it nice and damp. I should have did it with it not being on my head, but I already have it on. So I'm just spraying it to get it a little damp and using my fingers to run the conditioner through her and style her as such. And then I'm gonna take random sections of hair. Uh, there's no right or wrong way of doing this. I'm just doing some random sections and I'm just getting enough in the palm of my hand to whatever's comfortable. And notice how I'm just using my fingers. You don't want to comb or, you know, try to manipulate the curls in any kind of way. I'm just using my fingers, getting enough in the palm of my hand, and then I'm going to twist her, and I'm going to get rid of that part. So I'm trying to put the hair over it, but we're going to fix that in a minute. So I'm just going to twist it very, very lightly. Remember, I don't want to change the curls and put a loose top knot on the top and I'm going to take a bobby pin just one secure it on there and make sure it's centered or whatever and then I'm going to go back in that same little parting space I'm going to now take some more hair and then I'm going to take another bobby pin and flip some hair over it like that take another bobby pin and secure it down and then once I get that secured that's pretty much it I'm going to check in the mirror Make sure everything is in its proper place. Spruce her up. Spray her a little bit more. Um, get her looking a little bit fluffy. Remember, I'm not going to comb her or nothing like that. Get her a little bit fluffy. So now I'm going to show you what she's looking like from the front, the back, and the side. Here's what she's looking like from the front. Not bad. Here's what she's looking like from the side. She's still looking pretty good. This is the back. And she's still full. She's a full body wig. Love this about her. She's still pretty long. And um, this is the back. This is the side. The front again. And that is the other side. And that's it, dolls. Oh, if you want to know about this eye makeup, it's down in the description box below. And the nails, too, is down in the description box below. So this concludes the video. Don't forget to stay connected. I'm on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And I'll see you again shortly. Later, dolls.